Hi, I'm Peter Salmon. I'm the Managing Director of Moxie Design Group based in Wellington. We're a sustainable design and innovation company and we've been working for about 10 years in the sustainability arena. We've helped businesses communicate how they're managing sustainability and a lot more recently helping them start to explore the business opportunities through that lens. Through the experience we've had, we think that there's three basic tenants that really help us deliver on the services that we provide those kind of clients. The first thing is, is we don't see sustainability as an environmental problem or an environmental issue. We see it very much as a human issue. It's how we choose to live our lives, the impacts that that actually has on others and the environment at large. So it's about how do we continue to improve our quality of life without actually wrecking it for everybody else. The second thing is we think it requires design thinking and lots of it. We've woken every day since the Stone Age with designs on the world. There's nothing new in that. And we've got pretty good at it. In fact, we've probably got too good at it. So we probably want to think a lot harder about how we go about designing solutions for people in the marketplace. And the third thing is, I think for too long, sustainability has been positioned as barriers and limitations. We think this is the wrong approach. We think sustainability is all about business opportunities. There's new green markets that are actually opening up all throughout the world. We still have to continue to increase and improve on people's quality of life. This is about how we can do it in ways that actually provide benefit and value to everybody, business, society, the lot. So with those basic things in mind, we're going out trying to sell our message to the world. And we're starting to find that conversations like this are popping up all over the place. In North America and Europe, there's a lot more optimism around how sustainability has been spoken about in those places. So from our position, we've got to get there. And sure, we can get on a plane and go, and that can be lots of fun, but it can also be quite tiring after a while. So we need a better way to actually get to those marketplaces. And that's where Virtual Expos can really come in and support us. It provides us with a new platform, a new way to get out there and actually tell our story, to try and attract new business to the services that we can provide them. It's exciting. We're pretty thrilled by the opportunity of being involved with these guys and we fully endorse what they're trying to do. We're looking forward to working with them much closer in the future.